to a one night stand in Napier for Hastings and the weather is not particularly great it's been raining so uh, time to dress up <laughs> get some red weather gears on and uh, keep going rain or not, hey, let's do it well, I'm riding the edge of the storm what was behind me crazy and what's on the other side <laughs> I want to go there. I have to go there. Damn. Well, it is what it is. Let's keep going. All right, in right this very moment. Who knows? Maybe there is a bit better weather up there. I mean, feel like my forehead is all massaged <laughs> by the rain um, ah, not the most funnest ride ever but it is what it is yeah i just keep going i wish i could make a video of uh, of the road but i only use my cell phone so uh i have no rain cover for it so you have to do with that what would i show you like this but this is a uh, to a little town uh, kind of halfway between Hogs Bay and uh, Wellington region, quite a ripper. All right, let's get her going. <laughs> Finally, made it to the one night stand in uh, Hogs Bay. Bikes there, some sunshine, and there you go. That's about <laughs> I feel weird filming still, but oh my goodness, that's okay. Uh, here we go. I'll say I'll make a video of the bikes and uh, what's happening around. Uh, time to keep up. Time to set up a camp and uh, yeah, I'll be back. Chilly night, but lovely. Ah. It's time to almost wrap up and now um, get home. <laughs> All right, morning, morning, morning. Sun's up, not much stuff. Everybody's packing up, bikes are roaring. It's time to go. Uh, I'm half packed, I just need to put a tent together and uh, we are on the road. There is uh, Kinsman's Boys behind me, uh, Centurions down the road. Um, yeah, so um, everybody's uh, getting out to find some breakfast. I think I'm gonna just start heading home slowly and uh, find something on the way. So, um, yeah.
little village called uh, Norswood. It's an old Viking village. I'm gonna have a breakfast here. A couple other dudes rocked up as well. And um, yeah, it's really antique little place. It has uh, lots of little uh, museum items from the old days in New Zealand. And uh, yeah, it's quite a neat little place. There is an old police place, old police house here at the back, district jail, which you obviously try to avoid as much as you can. It's not um, good for health being locked up, <laughs> I suppose. I've never been, so uh, I can't tell exactly. But um, yeah, I might be running out of petrol. So I might be every I might have to use my can soon, but um, it's okay. We'll get we'll get further. Ah, this is Northwood. Happens I have run out of petrol, <laughs> and we are here. So um, I have to put my little petrol thing in there. If I can get to that, I think it's 20 kilometers to um, the next special stations. Hopefully we can make it. Catch fire, please. home just fine the weather held out petrol got me all the way to Dunnevirk petrol station and uh, my phone did cut out I uh, uh, run out of battery so um, yeah there is no more <laughs> past the petrol station hence the sh uh, sharp cutoff but yeah the bike ran fine we did maybe roughly 500 kilometers you can do your own translation to miles and uh, I think I will need to uh, uh, redo the points. Maybe there might be a bit of um, either condensation or abrasion from the rain. Uh, you know, gonna keep those electronics dry and clean. So um, I'll uh, do a video about timing the points. There is a uh, 79 iron also runs points, so I'll do a video on it too. Uh, but first, I have to um, fix my little failure uh, after I have. Uh, rebuilt the, the front brake I rebuilt the master caliper but I have reused the um, old uh, o-ring so now uh, brake fluid is leaking everywhere there is a little lovely cable so there is something to fix I don't know what size is it so I bought uh, two different sizes so hopefully some of them will fit and um, yeah we can get to the working on a rear brake at some point well hopefully soon alrighty so if you watch this thank you for watching thank you for participating in my adventures and uh, giving me your time to uh, see what I do um, feel free to subscribe like comment you know the usual shit um, and uh, I do 
feel free to watch some new dodgy videos with uh, uh, my phone falling off. Yeah. Don't don't judge me too much on uh, filming this with my um, dodgy handling of a selfie stick from one hand to another. Uh, you're gonna do what you're gonna do, and uh, the roads are pretty empty in those corners, so uh, it's been all right. Yeah. Maybe later on I get a different gear so I can mount it to the motorbike so my hands are free. But uh, for now, it's just a handheld thing. See you later.